What's going on, everybody? Welcome to another Mythic Cubes Singleton Draft with Highlander Elder Dragon Legend cards. I don't know what I just said. I have nothing. I blacked out. It was basically like you said nothing. It was. <laughs> you essentially said nothing of value. What do you think, Worm Coil Engine? Worm Boy. I also like Baleful Strix and Tropical Island. I like Legacy's Allure. That's pretty good. Is it? A little slow, though. It's a little dirtily. It looks pretty dirtily if you look at the art. It's derpy. You don't like Worm Boy? Yeah, I'm okay with the Worm Boy. I think it's Worm Boy. Hey, look, we can get another Worm Boy. Oh, Nicol Bolas God Pharaoh? Oh, how do I pass that guy? Is that the only Nickel Bolas in this cube now, I wonder? No, no, they're both in here. Ooh. You can get them both. I also like Flame Tongue Kabu. I like Dragon Lord of Tarka. So what are all his modes again? Plus two. They reveal cards. Actually, the plus two is really good in cube, I think. They reveal cards until you reveal a non-land, and then you get to play it for free. Which okay. is awesome, because all the cube cards are super powerful. Uh, plus one is each ex each opponent exiles two cards from their hand. Negative four just deals seven damage to a creature or a player, so you can literally just kill them off with that. And negative twelve is exile all non-land permanents they control. I think it's this guy. Okay. And hopefully we can get some fixing and just go like, uh, oh, that's fixing. That's a good one. I like a third pick Gilded Lotus. That's pretty good. Hmm. It's got to be this, right? Yeah. I like Hour of Devastation a lot. I bet that comes back, though. I'd also take a Liliana Heretical Healer. I think we just take all the the ramp that we can get. Tychonic Rift's real good. Yeah. It's also one of the only colors cards in our color, too, which is... But it's, it's also real good. We got wrecked by it. Did we come back in that game or no? I don't remember. What is it? What's the pick here? Uh, it's either Tamiyo or Icefall region, I think. There's also a duplicate. I do like a duplicate. Duplicate just gets rid of anything. I do like Tamiyo, though. Tamiyo also kind of gets rid of anything. Hmm. <laughs> hey, look! I donated to myself with a weird, uh, with a weird last. You like duplicate better? Yeah, I like duplicate as well. Frank Lapore, thank you so much. Really appreciate it. Cube times are best times. Water grave seems like where we want to be here. Yep. I like sower, but I can't. I can't take. I can't pass a, a fetchable dual land when we already got a nickel bolus dupes tammy tammy kyle with the 45 month resub oh my god dude four years Whew. you are three months away from four years that is insane man thank you so much dude i can't even that's that's unreal Kite sale freebooter? Opt? Actually, it might just be Rager. I like Rager here a lot. Over Booter? I do like Rager over Booter, I think. I wish my lips weren't so dry. You should try drinking liquids. You think that makes your lips less dry? Alright, six seconds, man. Booty. All right, we'll go booty. Dark petition. Oh, Rakdos's return with a with a gilded lotus. I like a Raki Kaki. I do too, actually. I think we take this Raki Kaki. Aki, Rak, Raki Kaki is Rakdos Cackler. No, that card doesn't exist. What? Wow. Not the duels we wanted. Not the duels we wanted, but Baleful Strix is good. Yeah. He's a bird. We can just be blue black splash these red cards. You can put a bird on it.
I have nipples, Greg. Can you put a burn on me? Yes. Really? Yeah. Racky khaki, five guards similar to Racky khaki. <laughs> oh, Lord. That's funny. It's just Mascara. Mascara wins so many games like that it has it's no business black, winning. Though. We got Gilded Lotus. And we're heavy black. We, we have two one red cards. We're just black blue. Okay. It's better than anything else. And, and this guy just wins games. Knew it. Or Came is it back. this guy? Um, nah, like our. Is it our or is it Seagate Oracle? That's me asking the chat. I, th I think our is very good, especially because there's so many planeswalkers in the cube. Two for C, man. The reason I don't like ours is because it is double red. But. Five cards to similar to Beautiful Chicken. Chicken a la King, Chicken Egg, Free Range Chicken, Mesa Chicken, Robot Chicken. Why There's are, a lot of chickens. Why are any of those cards? Like half of, I think four out of five of those are unhinged cards or un, unset cards. That is a lot of chickens. Look at all those chickens. Oh my god. Actually, it went C, C, C. Easiest hour, hour. So it's always just two to two, three, looks like. Demov, I will definitely look up Massive Attacks Insomnia. I don't think I've heard that. Thing in the ice? Seems okay. No, that's Fall Region came back. Oh, it's not Hypnotic Spectre. Is it Hypnotic Spectre? Um, I think Hippie's very good. He's alright. I'm going to take the Hippie. The Hippie Bibby. Roll that beautiful chicken footage. Why do you wish I was more like Mike? What What would, I, what would that... How would that help? Do you mean... Do you mean you wish I slept later? <laughs> I've yet to sleep till 10 a.m., but, you know, it could be done. Oh, Armageddon? We can put that in there. You love Armageddon. We can play it off Guild of Lotus. Oh, wow. Last pick Exhum? That's weird. Interesting. All right, you ready? Black Lotus, here we come. Nothing? Okay. Man. Man. I think I like two downfall? cards in this pack. Oh, I like three cards, actually. I like Dismiss, Control Magic, and Downfall. I miss Control Magic. Let's take that. You want to take the Control Magic? Yeah. E uh, yes. Yeah, I think it's Control Magic, too. I do like Dismiss a lot, though. And ideally, it will come back. But I think we're... uh. I think we're tapping out with this deck, so. I like this deck a lot. I want some more fixing for it, but I like it a lot right now. I do know Massive Attack. I don't think I've heard Insomnia is what I was saying. In fact, one of my favorite Massive Attack songs is the one they used uh, for the house opening credits. Sammy, have a good night, buddy. Um, is it Necrotol? This feels like a Necrotol pack. Those are Crux of Fate. I did like Crux, but we already have Hour. True. I'd rather kill one specific dude than... I don't know. All the dudes. I will take Necrotol. Get wrecked. Wow. That is a late Consecrated Sphinx. All right. I mean, sure. Can't look a gift horse in the mouth. If you insist. Can't look a gift weirdo mosquito Sphinx in the mouth. Look at the skinny arms. They're so weird. One is skinny. The other one's fat. Ugh. This is like the weirdest art ever. 
Alpstrom, they actually have Chupacabra and Necrotal and Shriekmaw and Bone Shredder, apparently. Speaking of which. Oh, let's take Shriekmaw. You want know to think we'll take Blood Crypt? I think it's Blood Crypt, right? Uh, yeah, that's a good point. And, and ideally, this, this, or this will come back. Probably not, but... You know, there's actually like f- it's funny because there's like five different these guys Chupacabra Blo- Bone Shredder Shriekmaw Necrotal and I imagine there's probably one more they just stuck them all in here it's really kind of weird so now if we get any any black fetch land gets us all three colors so that's pretty cool Wow. Wow. It was meant to be. From this moment, life has begun. From this moment, gonna take a shriek. That's not even a, not even a question, really. Not even a question. That's pretty good. This is all we ever wanted. What problem is? None problem is. Some problem, bro. No. Bro. Got Bobby. We got all of him to Turk. Scarab God. Him to Torox seems good. Him to Turkey. What up, my dog's name, Pig? What up, pigs? Clearly, Bob. Six drop, six drop, six drop, seven drop, five drop, five drop. I think it's Scarab God. Him to Torx seems real good, though. A little tough on the mana, but it's real good. Scarab God getting back any of the ridiculous creatures in this format seems so good, though. Yeah. I'm okay with it. I like Scarab God here. Oh, Languish? Oh, now we see the Giselle. Sure. I like that Languish doesn't kill a lot of our bigger guys. We already have Hour, though. I think it's probably just Demon. Demon's so good. Yeah, that guy's pretty good. All right, we'll just take Demon here. Also, our deck as a blue-black deck is actually pretty solid right now. And we can just splash for these two. We don't actually have to play the Hour right now. Hmm... Obliterator, obviously. It is, right? Yeah, we'll, we'll crush with that. Quadruple black, no problem. Oh, wow. Heroes oh, Downfall came one. back. That's actually fantastic. Also, Gary. I Actually, what if we... Oh, man. Maybe we should have taken the Gary and just focused on blue-black. Too late now. That's funny. I'm going to put this guy on the sideboard, though, because I don't have faith in that. You don't think so? I don't, I'm don't. i not having faith in quad-black at the moment. I, we could get there. We do have Gilded Lotus. But turn seven obliterator. All right. So every card that we we wanted and we picked something else instead, we got back. That's pretty cool. These were also the three in the pack that I was like, oh, these are nice. I okay. I think it's electrolyze. It's not red cap. It's pretty good too. I think electrolyze is a little bit better. I guess it's, it's harder. Hard, it's hard on the mana. Yeah. Could just be... Eh, I'm going to take this guy. Oh, see? Wow. All right, cool. This deck is building itself. This is good for a, an obliterator. All right, this guy came back anyway, but we're not playing him. You don't want Dark Ritual on the Hippie? I kind of do. I'd rather Dark Ritual into Obliterator on turn two, but... Drim big. That's a good one. That's a good one. Those are probably the only real good ones here. Solemn's pretty good. Solemn is good. It also ramps us. Uh, I love Dark Confidant. I just don't love Dark Confidant in this deck. This is not a Dark Confidant deck. This is a deck where you die. Yeah. 
What's the what's the pick here, man? I don't know. We're also very light blue as well. One, two, three, four, five, six blue cards. Ileana just seems like I don't think there's a lot of X ones in the format, you know. There's a ton. Look, there's like there's one. There's one in this pack by itself. <laughs> <laughs> I do think it's Ileana actually, um, especially because really... we have Dark Ritual. You like Badlands? Yeah, I'd take Badlands. Liliana might even come back. I'm gonna take the Badlands. I think it's I think it's better for us. Oh, Bloodstained Mire is perfect. Yeah, let's take that. Well, let's see. Like nothing in the pack that matters. I like these two. I think one of these two will actually come back. Gifted Aetherborn or Ultimate Price. Let's see. Bloodstained Mire is un unpassable when we have both Watery Grave and Badlands and Blood Crypto. And if we can get uh, an Underground Sea, I would actually I would lose my mind. Actually. You would lose your whole mind? The whole thing. It's all gone. Oh, wow. Oh, that's crazy. There's a Benser. She old red. She old red. Also a Benser. She older, I think, is, un is unbeatable in this cube, right? Uh, that's pretty good. I think we just take the she older. I took it. I didn't care what you thought. Wow. I ignored all of all of your life. My whole life? It's it's ignored. What up, Papa Perky? She's old, but she ain't. No, she is. and She's old and red, Michael. I mean, Alan. Oh, I got you guys confused. I'm sorry. It's okay. I'm so used to yelling at you. It happens all the time. I'm so used to yelling at you that I got, I got you guys confused. No. Really? This card's hard to deal with, man. It's also really hard to cast. You just tap your lands. What are you talking about? How often are we really going to get, like, what, the best you can get is negative four from that? How are we uh, going to get to negative four? Artifact creature. Instant. Planeswalker. Artifact. Said that. Probably negative four. Yeah, probably nine mana. Is this Karanos, then? I like Mana War. You like Mana War? Actually, yeah, I do kind of like we need this stuff to do early, we can win the late game. I like that. I like what you're saying here. Who was saying Karanos, though? Five mana, though. Ugh. Yeah, but this dude's real hard to beat. I also don't think it's ever going to be online. I'm going to take Mana War. I agree with you. I got you, fam. Let's just ponder. I think so. I'll just take Drana. Put counters on Murderous Red Cap, just infinite red caps. We have more creatures than I thought we did. We do. We actually have a ton of creatures. How are you going to cast that? You just tap your land, man. Do we go ponder? Is that what we agreed on? Yeah. It's not Liliana Vest, right? Nah, too slow. That's a good one. Ooh, Obby. I like that guy a lot. Also got a spicy Gomer. That is a Gomer. The Gomer. Man, we could actually have a, a sick mono black gray merchant deck if we took this guy. We already have Masquerum and Phyrexian Obliterator in the sideboard. Necrotal, Desecration Demon, Murderous Red Cap. Yeah, we're doing all right. I'm just going to take Ob. Ob is real good. <laughs> Spicy Gomer, two cards found. <laughs> uh, you agree with the Ob? Yeah. All right. Just trying, to, just trying to make sure you're concluded here, buddy. What's otherwise? What's the point? You know. Ooh, this is a tough one. It is a tough one. Like I don't know how many cards of ours are going to the graveyard. It's probably still better though. It's easier on the mana for sure. Yeah. What up, Dale Ellington? We don't want red that early. We also don't want red that red that early. I agree with that. Terminate's a better cut, but like that's that's not all we have to consider. Like we have to also consider mana costs or uh, mana like colors. Also, sometimes cut costs one mana, then it is better. Yeah, I think it's murderous cut. Moldrifty? Ooh, that's a spicy late one. I'm gonna take the crux of fate out. This we have a million creatures. Yeah, we don't need crux. Don't touch my crux, boy. This guy came back. Wow, that's surprising. Good deal. Let's see how many other cards we wanted that, that are coming back here. This guy's pure value. I was pure value once. 
What happened? I was I was no longer pure value. Can we just use this again? I think so. They didn't stop us. Just use it every time. We should also just get it to go. I think you get more food when you get it to go. And then we can watch The Office instead, which sounds better than sitting there waiting for food. Gifted Aetherborn? That was a dude I wanted to come back. He came back. Guys. Welcome back. Sometimes if you let those, sometimes if you love a gifted Aetherborn, you gotta let them go. And then if they come back, it was meant to be. Card's real good. And the Venser came back. Mm-hmm. As per usual. Do we just take Venser? Yeah. I like that. This is actually far more cuts than I was expecting because I didn't think we were going to get all these good cards back. Okay. Our mono black deck would be actually be insane. I think our current deck is also insane. I think it's also... Yeah, I think it's very good. Don't get me wrong. We need like four cuts though and I'm not really looking forward to that. I also think this guy's good enough to just main deck. No, I like that guy. I don't think we cut that guy. I don't think we need a Bone Shredder, a Necrotal, and a Murderous Red Cap. I think we can probably cut Red Cap. Yeah, I think he's the weakest of those. Mm, just take Terminus. Sure. I don't know if I care about this. Like, without, like, mana ramp, I don't think this is as good. I mean, we have quite a bit of ramp. Like, Guild of Lotus is, like, our only ramp, right? And Solemn. That's not really... I don't want to be playing this on turn, like, six, though. All right, cut it. Two cards, two more cards. All right. I'll say murderous cut's probably going to be a two. I think we can cut freebooter. I agree. I think it's kind of a weak link. Shielded, maybe? Get out of here. It does seem really strong, especially with like Necrotals and Vencers and stuff. Or are we just 41 card special it? Yeah, I don't want to make any more decisions. <laughs> That's literally how I feel sometimes. I'm like, I don't want to gauge this. Like, this is... Like, this would be... What are the odds of cutting this? I don't know. 96%. What about this? 97%. 94%. I don't want to wait. I don't want to do this. All right, so... Do we even... Four sources? Do we even... Yeah, we don't even need one. No. Our only red card now is Nicol Bolas, which is pretty sweet. And you have Guild of Lotus, too. So six, seven, eight, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Seven, eight, nine, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. This is eight. This is nine, ten. And then and four, five sources, four, four sources of red with the guild list. Yeah. This does get a red though if we put, if we add a mountain. I don't think I care about that though. Um. Kind of do want a mountain, but I just don't think we can fit it. I don't think so either. This is a like this this deck has heavy mana requirements. Yeah, just play it as is. Cut Vencer and control for obliterator and dark ritual. That's interesting. This still doesn't leave us model black. Yeah, I also don't like cutting control magic. Like it's just very good. Cards bonkers. Alright, this seems pretty sweet. I like this deck. Our sideboard's also real strong. I think Mask Worm's a good sideboard. It's Crux of Fate, Liliana, Freebooter, Red Cap. All solid sideboard cards. I'm okay, Dad. Time for a late night, late time rhyme. The clock is late, so I don't have the time. This deck looks sweet as modern with blood braid elf. Can't really help to smile to myself. Can't really help to, but smile to myself. Frank playing cube is clearly the way. This deck looks sweet. And what do you say? We ignore Mike's life like a piece of trash. Now I'm tired and gonna go crash. We don't need to play some tribe, but please chat, do subscribe. Peace. Zaxor, you are you are the best. This is actually this hand is perfect because we can get water grave with this for double blue. Hey, look, an X one. Hey, listen. Hey, listen.
Why are there so many people with a mountain fetish? I don't get it. Oh, God. If you have, like... I don't know if the combo's in here or not. What combo? The, like, this... The devoted druid combo. I don't know what that is. Really, with the guy from uh, Hour of Devastation that lets you not get counters on your cards? Oh, and you take a bunch of turns? Yeah. No, you... What? No. No. There's the card... What's that guy called? I'm sure they'll just play it now and kill us. It's like a 2-1. It says creatures you control can't have counters on them or something. So, like, you have this guy, and you add a counter. You add a mana. And then you put a negative 1 counter on it to untap it. So it untaps, but it doesn't get the counter. So you can just keep doing that and make infinite mana. Oh. Well, apparently it didn't. That's pretty good. So you have to get rid of this guy in order to... So our actually, we're in really good shape, I think. What do we get? Lotus Cover? All right. What do we exile? Farseek? Sure. So they can't fight here, or else this guy dies, right? Don't get rid of my gift today, they're born. Really? Why are you that? Why are you the way that you are? Super rude. I was feeling good. Now I'm feeling sad. Oh boy. They have two cards. Like, again, we get all of this and like, why do it? Somebody feels like we always, always feels like we have so many more cards than our opponent with these decks. Okay, that's pretty good. Are you gonna kill this? No. Okay. No, well, that's a good one too. I kind of just want to draw a card here, right? We're not killing one of these guys. No. Hmm. All right, well. We do have to find a way to get through this, unfortunately. I guess Sphinx does a good job. Of course, if they go negative two Elspeth, negative three Elspeth to kill everything, it's pretty bad. Wow. That's in there. Okay. This is weird. I guess if your two cards look like this, it's pretty good. I'm not having a good time anymore. Well, now they have to kill their own Carnage Tyrant if they want a negative Elspeth, so that's a thing. But they probably just do that anyway, right? Probably not. Really? They negative Elspeth. They kill all of these guys. They negative they five to our Obnixilis. They have five guys and Elspeth and a bunch of dudes, and we have nothing. Oh, well, that's actually perfect. Actually, then we just play Shouldered, right? Oh, oh. Okay. Well, I'm okay with what you just did. Probably just trying to alter. Yeah, apparently. Hmm. So you're going at him. You're all going at him. You're going at him. If you're all going at Ob, then we're just going to block a bunch of idiots. Wow. Man, that's a lot of man. Jeez, this guy's last three cards have been pretty good. Yeah, like, <laughs> what's even happening Carnage right Tyrant, now? Elspeth, Guy's Cradle, and Primeval Titan. Jeez. Where's the Crux of Fate? Where was that Crux of Fate when we needed it? It's on our side board. I guess we're bringing that in. It's frustrating because we just got so many duders. Because we can hear his downfall, but that's all we can do. Duplicate does not get past Hexproof, otherwise that would have probably been our turn and stealing the uh, Carnage Tyrant. Because it still targets, so. Like, we can shield her. They sack a 1-1 one, one, and then they kill us. Like, we just have to, we have to hear his downfall here. Yes. Not sure if we're even dead either way, though. 
This is a lot of things. And we don't have very much. I think we're dead anyway. I'm going to go to the next game. Yeah, I don't I'll, think we're winning. I'll let, him, I'll let him take their turn. We do get to draw after all, so murderous cut would be reasonable. Scared bad. All right. Oh, yeah, worm. Can you imagine if we hit a massacre worm here? This is why we're bringing massacre worm. Wow. Yoakum, 48 months in a row. Oh, my God. Okay, so 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 7, and 6. Also another 13. So 26 damage coming at us. We can block here and take 23. Block here and take... All right, so we can do this. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. No, we're dead. <laughs> like we can chump block here and here. Three, so seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. We'd survive. It's not ideal. Nope. Spamming chat with ninety six hundred emotes would be kind of comical. All right, I think that's game. Yeah, I don't I think, see why I think we're dead. All right, well, we're bringing in Crux of Fate and uh, Massacre Worm. So I'll take out the duplicate. I don't think a one of is really going to. And this guy will take out probably Murderer's Cut. Like, they didn't have many one ofs that we really wanted to kill. And we still have Necrotol and Bone Shredder for those moments. Sure. Sure, buff. Sherpa. Mm -hmm. Tempted to bring an hour too, actually, especially for planeswalkers. Let's take out one island and a mountain. Bring an hour. What are we? What are we taking out? Hypnotic Specter. I don't like Freebooter because I. Well, they didn't really have that many spells. Uh, how about Mana War? Mana War seems bad here. All right. Hypnotic Specter, I like because it's a flyer that can get through, and it's also. Uh, I'll keep this hand. Any blue and it's insane. Yeah, any one blue and we're, we're in good shape. Two blue? Even better. Oh, yeah, we could have got Demon. I like Demon, though, because our plan is to actually um, deal with all their tokens and things. So that's a good follow-up for if we, when we do that. All right, do your do your do your worst. That is not my favorite land. Oh god, they're ramping real fast. I'm uncomfortable. That was a good draw. Wow, especially with nothing on board. That's actually a really good draw. We'll get in there first. Come on, bomb. Yes. Oh. That's definitely one of Yes! Primeval Titan. Okay, that's good. That had to be what they were going for. Yep, that's what we figured. We have Bone Shredder. That's fine. We can also just put a Pelucranos in play. Hmm. There's old Hee Haw. That is old hee haw. No, I'm sure. Do we exile or do we just Pelucranos out? I wonder. Or keep going up. Because we have to lose our. Pelu our... No, Pelucranos, Pelucranos is four. Is four. Yeah. Missed the land drop, but I think we're still doing okay here. They have four cards. Sure. 
Sure. Don't really care about that. Nissa on top. They don't like that. Planes on top. I guess you probably like that a little better. Zenith on top. Actually, we're just going to exile it, so I don't know why that matters, I guess. Sure. Just a young goat boy. Probably not paying for this. Nah. I actually feel like we bounced this guy. With what? It's like Lockrip. Oh. Like, is they're going to tap these three and and do a thing I'd rather just but then they get the green sun zenith which is pretty bad no well, you just exile right because then they just block our hypnotic specter yeah so either we either don't attack with the hypnotic specter but the thing is if we if we I guess like we I guess Ashiok could just so if we exile Ashiok goes to 9 but then they get to attack it for 5 and we have no real recourse for that I wish we had a Venser. I wish we had a second blue instead so we can play Venser and just bounce this guy and still have a body to block. Sure. Yeah, they're going to uh, yep. I mean, we need two lands, but I'm pretty sure we probably just win if we're able to slam a massacre room down. Guy's Krill, sure. Don't mind hitting that. Pride Mage on top. Just crack your thing. Yep. I hope it's a land and you draw it. Cobra, sure. That's just, that, as far as I'm concerned, that's another card that's going to get uh, Massacre Wormed, but we do need two more lands. I mean, we do need two more lands for Massacre Worm, so I'm not really super... Uh, and one of them has to be black. Druid. But one land gets us into... Scarab God or Mass or Venser, so that's pretty good. Oh, we got Tri Builder actually. That's really good. Oh, we can't attack with Hippie anymore, so. Cobra! Yokum, Critters Under, Ashiokar, Tri Builder, Bloodbraid, and Pelucranos. Cultivate with 10 cards in your deck? Wow. Did they just miss? Wow, they failed to find basics. All right. Seems good. Uh, I think we just actually... Evoke it. Yeah, we have no choice, actually. We have nothing else to do, so... It's pretty good. Now I'm wondering if we do mill them. No, we want to put we want to put a guy into play because otherwise we just get our we get crushed. Yeah, they're gonna kill it anyway. And they got tyrant on top. Okay, so two four six two four six. Yeah, they they'd be dead. I mean. Actually, more realistically, they'd go to two. But. So, Tyrant and a Druid. We're we going Ashiok, Ashiok, Ashiok. Everybody's going to Ashiok. Okay. Seems good. All right, it's dead. We get it. Oh, that's going at me. That's going at me. Okay. I almost don't even want to block them because it's just more damage if we don't. You block with the Elder inside? Yeah, that's what we're doing. Island. 
So play a thing. So I think this is going to be Xaxes, right? Put them to 14, kill their whole board. They take exactly 14. Seems good. <laughs> nice. Oh, got him. Why don't the elders damage two on the stack and kill... Wait, we don't... Wait, what? Damage hasn't gone on the stack for like 10 years. Yeah, you can't do that. Oh, we didn't block... With spec Carnage Tower doesn't have reach. It's even not a world even breaker. if damage were on the stack, we wouldn't want to do that because we wouldn't kill them. We don't want to kill their guy. We wanted them to take two more life so that we go to Xaxes. Like, we, we did the math. <laughs> Yeah, and again, if you look at that game, like they had very few creatures that were actually uh, that we wanted to singly target. Like they're either Car Carnage Tyrant or a bunch of tokens. So, this is a cute. Get your calculator out. Hold on. Okay. Okay, so it was two damage per creature times seven creatures, but they were at 16. So we had 14 damage. 16 minus 14. Okay, so they would have been at two. We needed the Hypnotic Spectre damage. That's a little meme. That's a little calculator meme for you guys. Um, I think we're fine, right? Yeah. I believe the, the damage on the stack change was in 8th edition. Which came out in... Uh, let's find out. 2003. Let me, let me look it up. Damage on stack. Uh, the change. Damage on the stack. 2002. Oh my god. Is that right? Oh my god, it was 6th edition. Is it? No, because this might have been... I don't know. You guys figure it out. Is this hand good? It's real slow. But it's kind of not slow if we hit a land. I think we can mulligan this, right? We have nothing to play here. Where are you going? I was reading this. To oh, see okay, if it was... all right. I'm going to mulligan. This is much better. Wow, this is much better. Um... No, we want more lands. We want more. We want blue sources. Zaxor, have a good night, buddy. All right, red source, blue source, come on. Blue source incoming. Love it. Yeah, six is when it was added. You can see it right here. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's what I figured. Oh, that's a good one. That's... And 10 sounds about right for when it was... Why do I even do this? Why do you do anything? I don't know. God, this is so much land. So they get one mana here. They can crack this to get another mana. And then a third mana from the land they get. So that's three mana. They could do another 3B on this turn. Cobra putting in work. Uh, I think a three land hand with a bunch of cards. Is, I mean, I'm not going to go to four here. Or five, rather. I'm going to get this guy off the board so we can just play Nightmare Ashiok here. Wow, nothing? Tooth and Nail and Kodama's Reach. Okay. Always glad to see Tooth and Nail gone. Same. Here comes really Primeval Titan every game. Crux is going to be pretty key. Here comes Prime Time. That guy's good too. Pretty sure we just mold Drifter here. We 
what are we gonna we don't we, we can't cast a cut if we get a cut so we'll actually oh we can't actually do anything else so yeah this is fine okay well we got a crux of fate next turn so hopefully they do something ridiculously see you later Ashiok. yeah Ashiok was not long for this world Okay, now I now I'm now I'm hundred percent okay with cruxing this this board. I was hoping they would extend something else, but this is like the best I could have asked for, I guess. And then we can follow it up with that guy, sure. Destroy all non dragon creatures. That'd be the worst misclick of all time. I would cry. That's pretty good. Oh, you're just making a Shia. That's pretty good. Two cards, huh? Apparently, they're both very good. No, oh, that's that guy's average. I mean, Ob Nicholas, we just or we could just bone shred on that guy. Wow, I don't want you to have that at all. That is unfortunate. Oh, that's Looks pretty like good. Looks like they get all their bombs. That's that's fun. It's really hard to be an opponent when they always get all their bombs. I agree with you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve mana. So if they play a land, they have oh they have no cards in hand. God, I really wish I had to get rid of your top the top, top card of your deck. Yeah, that'd be pretty good. It just has to be consecrated sphinx here, right? I think they so. can't kill it. They take thirteen mana to kill it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. They have the top deck land. Go land for 13th mana. Six to Consecrated Sphinx. Technically it's possible, but... I also one mana shy of just playing Nicol Bolas and exiling this to... Oh, it's so, so frustrating, dude. Yeah, it's brutal. Cloud Goat Ranger on top. And planes. Look at this value. Elspeth Farseek in hand, sure. Well, Elspeth Farseek Cloud Goat. Pretty sure we're dead now. They can actually just six this guy. 11, 12, 13, 14, 16, 17. They, they actually put us to one here if they see it. Which is actually unbelievable. We just Crux defeated their, their Primeval Titan Carnage Tyrant. That's pretty ridiculous. Oh my god, are they not going to do it? Oh my god, really? You're going to let me block? Okay. What? This is so, this is so strange. They could have just posted one. Why did you not crux? We did crux. It's in the graveyard. We killed Pelucrin. We killed Primeval Titan and Carnage Tyrant. I don't know what that means. Sure. That's just fine. Yep. Actually, pretty good. Yeah, they rebuilt really fast. Crux on Primeval Titan Carnage Tyrant was medium? Wow. You guys are hard to please. <laughs> that seems insane. 
If we didn't take that, we would have taken like a million. Eleven damage. Can you can you imagine how good um our devastation would be here? Really good. Really good is the answer. I think we didn't draw it. We have we can play one card in our hand. We can play Demon and Bone Shredder, but then they just make their guys. Bone Shredder kills this guy. No, we're not dead. Our still saves us, I think, if we Bone Shredder the 7-7. Seven, seven. And we'll say Meyer gets us an extra looky loo unless we already played a land. No, we did, but... Okay. That crux was what? I'm okay, Dad. Oh, I see. I'll look for us on top. I imagine you're going to play that. Oh, it's Crow Tribe Builder. I imagine you're going to use your Nissa to draw that. We do not have in Garrick's Wake. No, oh, I see. Farsi, gone. What's the one card in your hand? What did I miss? Oh, is it Cloud? It's Cloud Guard Ranger. Forest on top. Draw the forest. Song of the Dryads. Okay. Demon and kill two tokens a turn mode isn't good, but it's still a thing. Like we still we just have to play it. That was weird. What? Huh. I'd rather just kill a token here. I'll take one more damage and just kill a token. So we take one, two, three, four. We go to five. We're going to take three off of... We just want an hour. One time hour, please. Play Cloud Goat. Let us hour. And then we actually have a game. No Cloud Goat. Okay. No hour. Okay. Hmm. Song of the Dryads, we can actually put on, like, Nyssa or Elspeth? Yes. But then we die to Bloodstained Mire. We do? Because we're going to have to crack this at some point. Why? What do you mean, why? Because we need a second red source for, like, hour. So we go get... We, we only have Blood Crypt. So we have to... We have to crack this, so we go to four. And we have four power on board. I mean, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Sometimes you just can't crack it. I mean, that's life. It's only real play, right? <laughs> yeah, alternatively, like, we could play Obnix list and kill his 2-4, but then, like, he just starts upping Elspeth. And we lose to that. But the point is, okay, so here, we, if we if we play this and crack it for something, uh -huh. we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine mana, which means we can Scarab God and get something back in the same turn. Which is extre which becomes extremely relevant, sure. When we can get like Primeval Titan or Carnage Tyrant or you know, uh, four four Bone Shredder, sure. Back, um, we just we don't have the technology. Well, yes, I'm trying to figure out if we can crack this and go to four. Like crack this, go to four. Nickel Bolas, negative four to kill Corsair of Crufix. Or maybe not. Actually, maybe we just play Nickel Bolas, kill this. I think this is just going to kill us if we don't kill it. Yeah. We also just play Nicol Bolas. And, oh, actually, yeah, let's plus Nicol Bolas. I think that's our only... I think it's the best play. The problem is we go to one. How do we deal with four guys on board? Three guys on board? Plus an Ashaya. I don't know. And they're going to have... Then they're going to have the other dude. Song on Corsair just doesn't... These are our problem cards, right? Like, we have to figure out how to actually win the game after that point. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, eight mana. Oh, God. I think it has to be this dude. So song on top. Actually, song turns it into a forest. Yeah, that's unfortunate. So they're going to draw song, and then we're just going to hope to hit. We're just going to hope for hour on top. Nickel Bolas. We play Nickel Bolas. We get hour on top. We're good to go. That's all we want. 
Mm. There is Massacre Worm in the deck, too. Yeah, that would buy us another turn. Also, Nicol Bolas sh should live if they don't just song it. What is this? You just draw Declaration in Stone? Okay, so you have Song. Why did 65? Where's those numbers? Oh, okay. They song it. Yep, that's what I figured. Yep. Why aren't they playing? It's so funny they're not playing Cloud Go Ranger, though. One, two... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. If they're anime, one thing. The problem with reanimating things is that it becomes a four, four. True. Which means Elspeth kills it, but then they lose their Elspeth, right? So. Yeah, we're at three, so aren't we still dead? Two blockers. Well, yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, we're dead. Unless there's something I'm missing. There's always something you're missing. How do we gain nigh life with Corsair? That seems insane. Oh, Obnixilus and plus and see if we draw it. See if we draw what? Hour. One, two, oh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, but then we're going to take three to get it. So how do we do that? Plus we took another one from this. Um, plus your micro goes to two. Ob goes to one, so we get a one. What? How? Obnixilus costs a, a life to gain, a, gain to draw a card anyway. Right. So we go to two. Yeah. Cracking this, the only land we have left to get that will let us cast our is Bloodstained Mire. No, we have bad lands. That's what we needed. Yeah, we have bad lands. That's what we needed. Wow. It's, I mean, it's it's still a one outer, but it's it's something. Oh my god, the bad lands changed everything. Oh my god. So yeah, but if we get Corsair, it puts us to four, which still we're still dead. Yeah, we're still dead to that. So we kind of actually have to get that, right? Yeah, it's our only out. Let's go for it. <sighs> All right. Oh my God, the Badlands changes everything. I wish I'd known that sooner. I would have done it ahead of time. No, that it wouldn't work for the other turn. Are we sure there's nothing we can get with uh, Scarab God? Lotus Cobra doesn't do it. Primal Titan, Carnage Tower. Nope. Strix, Mull Drifter, Ashiok. Nope. Consecrated Sphinx, Demon. Bone Shredder kills a guy. Not enough. No, they just use Elspeth and kill us. All right. We're going to go Ob. Yeah. We tried. tried. Yeah. Yeah, this game was fine, I think. It was a good match. Worm coil would have been nice, but it wasn't anytime soon. Wow, wow. I guess worm coil would have been. Is out. it in the deck? Nope. Let's see if it's the last card. How about that? It's looking good. Oh, actually, cyclonic rift would have also been amazing. Oh my god, is it really going to be the last card? A third, 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 fourth card in the deck. All right. All right. Actually, was there a thing we wanted to change? I don't maybe, think so. Maybe not. I think the deck's fine. Man. Our opponent just went a little too wide, which is weird because we had like three sweepers. We have our, we have uh, Crux of Fate, yeah, and one. we have Masquerum. Worm. Brian, trip was good. Had a good time. Had, had a great time. Steven C., thank you so much for the sub. Welcome, welcome back. I came for Frank, but I stay for Mike. Keep being awesome. I'll, I'll do what I can. I can't speak for this guy, but... I ain't doing nothing. He isn't doing nothing. It's good that Grix's piles lose sometimes. They're so hyped, I just need... Yeah, I agree with you. Did I bring you ba anything back? Well, I haven't been back to you, so I, I, I couldn't get it to you anyway, so... Oh, wow, another another green rampy deck. I'm having green a good... Where it's at. Oh, 100% cycle this guy next turn if I, if I don't... If I don't have anything else to do. Cold Steelheart. 
Your mother's a cold steel heart. Is she? Oh, that's exactly what I wanted. Yeah, I can't believe I forgot the Badlands. That would have changed. Like, it would have changed my mentality, though. Like, I would have been... Okay, it only takes one damage instead of three. Oh, the old... The old black-green deck. It's nice to know that most of the black decks can't deal with this guy because he's black. So that's pretty cool. Oh my god, live all one, two, three, four, five, six, nine mana? I feel like we just have to kill that guy somehow. Well, not like this. Not like this. <laughs> Why do I feel like I'm like one turn behind? Can't like you only use his second ability if you have a four power dude in play? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's formidable, right. Then you get Prime of the Titan. Oh, thank God. Then you get biorhythm, boy. Do I Mold Drifter here? I don't actually see a turn where I'm going to be able to Mold Drifter. Next turn we're going to play this. Then we play a million and million things. I'll just evoke this guy. Cut's pretty good. Eventually. That was a good hit. I'm okay with that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what he was trying to do. I would imagine that would definitely be my goal as well. And then he could buy a rhythm dust and we'd be dead. Don't buy a rhythm me, bro. Here we go. Here we go. Something broken. I only have three mana, so it can't be that broken, I guess. Well, I got six mana, I guess. No, five mana. Here we go. Hmm. Interesting. Super aggro. That was a good draw. Old necky tall. I wish I had With one the tall more. necky. Again, I wish I had one more mana, because then I can actually Gilded Lotus and then play any one of these three. Well, yeah, any one of these three. I wish I could delve for my opponent, too. But alas was not meant to be hit. give me a good hit cultivate okay I'm pretty sure it's just Necrotal here yeah got to be starting something uh, 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 uh. yeah yeah that's Michael Jackson did you know that no did you know that I couldn't really tell because you went, hinny, 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 hinny. <laughs> and that's not really a song. So, oh man, it's a song. This guy's dead. He is dead. What kind of four drops he got in there? Oh, just out of curiosity, who's the friendly looking guy behind you? His acoustic son. <laughs> My name is Randy. Randy Dandy. His name's not Randy Dandy. My name is Randy Dandy, and I'm here to say. His name isn't any of those <laughs> things. Ravenous Chupacabra. Oh, that's right, because they made this guy strictly better than every other creature that comes into play before him. I hate I hate everything about what this my opponent chooses to be. <laughs> <laughs> See, again, we're doing this 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 like we could play Gilded Lotus, have three mana, mm -hmm. so we could ponder, leaves us with two mana, and then we could murderous cut exiling all three and kill something, but we actually don't have that because this only gives us three of one color, so getting real tired of it. What you gonna do? I'm gonna Lotus and cut. Okay. Because it's the right thing to do. Oh. Look, he said his name was Randy Dandy. I believe him. 
I guess we could have hit a black source off ponder, but that's a little that's a little risky. Oh, good. Give that dude indestructible. Is it indestructible? Is that what it gets? No, it just dies. You manifest the top card. Sure. Well, I'm never blocking this guy, just to be clear. God, I hope this isn't something broken. Okay, actually, he's just my friend Mike. He's my friend Mike. He streams with me very regularly. So. Or irregularly. Hey, man, look. Shrimpzilla's still up here. Dang. No one's bought Shrimpzilla Only yet. 14 bones. Oh, Wicker Ball Lighter. How, how nice that you get to kill my Guild Lotus without actually losing a guy. And you actually make it a 4-4. I ain't paying $14 for no shrimp. I like that you guys are all suggesting Ponder for a land. If I don't hit it, I'm actually so far behind to a Whisperwood Elemental. Looks like our opponent drafted the uh, the perfect pooping pod deck. Pooping pod. Uh, pooping pod. That's where you're going with. I'm going to do one of these jobbies. Why am I doing that? We just have nothing good. Oh, God. We can duplicate the Therag Tusk. Which isn't that great. Yeah, they get a 3-3 and we get a 5-3 out of it. We get no perks. Whatever. I need to look. I need. I just need to know. I want to know. Can you show me? Cyclonic Rift is not bad. It's not bad. It's better when you have eight mana. You mean seven? It's only seven, and oh, we really? have we'll have seven next turn. Oh yeah, let's do that then. And we get the Badlands, which is cast Nikki B. Yeah, this is actually keepable. All right, pass it up. Pass pass five six seven eight nine. We take nine though. Ouch. Ow, Chihuahua. Look at my shrimp. My shrimp is amazing. Uh, it doesn't matter if it's exiled. This is when it dies. It's when it leaves the battlefield. That's the best part about Thrag Tusk. You can exile it. You can... Kill it, it, no matter how. Yeah, you can even if you bounce it, they still get one. No so. matter what you do, I will have a three-three. I don't think we block yet. Really? Go to nine. All right, I'll just chump then. Fine, because you want me to, I'll chump. What do you need a stinking necrotol for? I don't know, man. Sometimes I just like be having a necrotol. Hmm. Rager Cager. Axel, thank you so much, man. Welcome back. Really appreciate it. You are awesome, buddy. Oh, they didn't do anything. They didn't even pod? That's weird. Pass the turn. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. What if we just play duplicate here? Eat their 4 4. Block this guy. That seems reasonable, right? And then try to do the time warp again later. Because I want to put myself in a position where, like, Venser actually does something. But if we bounce this guy, like, it's just worse for a duplicate anyway, so. Excel, what'd you have last week, buddy? What is this weird... What is this weird emote... What is this? Where did this come from? Oh, it was Oh, it was flipped up. Oh, that's pretty good. It's just a 2-1. Isn't that just straight worse? Did they think this was going to trigger? Yes, clearly. That's pretty interesting. Yeah, because that's strictly worse than the 2-2 uh, the it was previously. Unless it's a 3-drop now, so you can birthing pot it. Which is actually fine. I mean, what's that imager link?
Oh, the swag <laughs> tusk. Swag is bringing life to the party and making sure a homie isn't alone when leaving. Nice. Like you do. I'm going to just block this guy. We're going to Cyclonic Rift, so I want to get this token out of the way. Yep. Master. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Three, four, six, seven, eight. We can actually go to one and then Cyclonic Rift on their turn and then just slam a Nickel Bullets. Why would we go to one? Because I don't want them to replay anything on their turn. Oh, sure. Yeah, we could do that. <sighs> oh my god, you had a power outage, dude? Are you serious? How long did that last? 196 days. No, that was the original one. He's in Puerto Rico. Get up, get up, yeah, yeah. Did we just go to one? I think we just go to one here. Bounce everything at the end of their turn. Nickel bullets. Sometimes you got a risky for the bisky. So they have heart, pod, master. What was the other card? Rager. Rager. And the token does not exist. <laughs> that is correct. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Nope, that's not going to work. Need a red boy. Sure. Never tapping that. Mm, boy. Intimidating. I don't think so. No? God, please don't have... Uh... So, one, two, three for Birthing Pod. One, two, three for Rager, and then they get a uh, Murderous Red Cap and kill us. That would be good. Please stop lying. Trump made sure Puerto Rico had power within four weeks. <laughs> uh, we didn't play Nickel Bullets there because it just dies on board. So we get the Cyclonic Rift and now they have to restart and figure out how they're going to. Yeah, appreciate it. Like politics in Twitch chat is just not a good time. No one's going to no one's gonna come out ahead there. Two Veps. Thank you for catching the stream, man. Really appreciate it. All right, so no more Rager. This is 100%. They're going to pod here. Varaska. This can't kill planeswalkers, right? That would be insane. Okay. Two dudes. We have a bunch of dudes, too. That was actually a good draw. They have nine cards in their deck. Oh! No. Uh -uh. Yeah, let's cast that. I think I have some walkers. Healthy. Goosh. Did I play a land this turn? No. Okay, good. Did you just goosh? I totally gooshed all over, bro. Whatever that means. We can also bounce the Vraska, which is pretty good. Yeah. Cube is up, correct. So you'll have to live vicariously through tweets. I figured. Had a feeling you might kill that. Which is actually just fine. I wish I got to keep that guy because then we can make actually these guys formidable threats. But as of now, not so much. Yeah, that's fine. <sighs> OK, 
getting real tired of everybody having that dude. You can make another thing for the turn. They have six cards in their deck. Actually, if they want to go get lands, cool. So they have they still have pod. They don't have master. What was heart? What was that card? Cold seal? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So they, we know two of the four cards in their hand at least. Yeah, we're definitely trying to mill him. Or her. Mill him good. I finally get to dust off my Jace's this Sunday attorney. I haven't been excited to play. Yeah, right? I know that feeling. He didn't get any lands. It actually feels like Modern's a new format. Oh, that's fine. Okay, so we know the two cards in your hand, so that's very reasonable. We are at one, and this guy is trampled, though, but... You can bounce it once, though. Yeah, that's true. That's pretty good. Hey, that's pretty good. Oh, my God! That's real good. The cards you're giving me are fantastic. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm gonna, I need to keep this guy up. Oh, we just win. <laughs> fantastic he's seen enough all right is crux of fate crux of fate seems good against the pod deck and yeah i also like massacre worm again because the hornet queen and whatnot yeah and avenger of zendikar yep this does seem like more of a duplicate deck though so i'm okay with keeping that in there mana war seems fine like we can take that guy out we have a lot of things to do on three demon can probably come out again yep i think that's fine Yeah, those are pretty good pretty good Nicobolas hits there. Thanks for the cards. Red Cap seems decent, but I feel like um Necrotal, Murderous Cut, and Heroes Down and uh Bone Shredder or not not Murderous Cut. Bone Shredder and Necrotal are the better ones. Like we have Ugh. Oh Ponder, actually. Keep it because of Ponder. Hundred percent keepable with Ponder. That's what you say now. Ready? I'm waiting. Ship it. Here comes Badlands. I accept. Some guys. I thought it was a good land. <laughs> oh my God. You need to stop. You're not. No one's happy with what you're doing right now. Are you sure? Yes. Oh, God, no. Jit should never be on Madden Modern. Ugh. I don't want anyone to ever... Like, anyone who says that Jit should be on Madden Modern... is just a madman. Nicobolus, I think, would be too strong at 6 instead of 7. It's just too versatile. And it, it's too high. Like, it starts at, like... It essentially starts at 7, right? Does it start at 5 and go to 7? Let's find out. I don't know. How are we going to find out? All right, I really need to we'll kill these guys. It. The power of ramp compels you. The power of cheese. You can't even really play Ashiok here. It just does nothing. Just dies. Correct. I'm just going to bounce their stupid idiot. Just time walk him. Oh, time walking. Keep on rolling. Means the same move. going to keep on time walking. Yeah, I mean, it, let's make some make them do the turn again, and we also get to uh, murderous cut it next turn, which is nice. And then we can start playing Scarab God, I guess, because I don't think they're going to have a really good answer to it. I guess Chupacabra is, but then we can just replay the Chupacabra. Chup. Splinter Twin definitely Chup, deserved Chup, the axe, Chup. and I don't think you were paying enough attention to Modern if you think it did not. That is a uh, con 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 contentious point of mine. That was a great draw. Didn't get any puppers. Good job. Zero puppers. Guy from the background in Florida is back. I don't... All right. Well, I will get two forests. Seems good. I 
That was a really good draw, too. Holy smokes. Let's get a bad land immediately. Murderous cut for two. We could also play Ashiok. That seems good. Elder. That was nice. All right. Scarab God seems reasonable. We only have Master of the Wild Hunt in the graveyard. I really don't want them. This is four, five, six, seven, eight. I don't want them to play Hornet Queen or Avenger next turn. If we can avoid it. So we're trying to avoid it. And we also have Massacre Worm. Yep, that's pretty okay. If we can hit one land to Massacre Worm here, it's actually insane. They take eight. They have no guys on board. We have Ashiok Massacre Worm. Any land. That'll do. And we got a shoulder out of it. Wow. Yep, this game just ended. And we got Lethal on board. Yep. It's <laughs> pretty good. And we got Scarab God with uh, Frixion Rager, Jade Light Ranger, Ravenous Chupacabra as options. And a Necrotal. Okay. Seems okay. Primeval Titan. They always they never don't have it, do they? I guess we just bounce this guy and kill them. <laughs> that seems good. Done. BC, anytime, buddy. Thanks for the... Uh, whatever that means. I don't know why I'm doing this. I'm just going to kill them. Well, I see a couple extra cards, but... Yeah, but the game will be over. There's no game three here. Oh, we won the first one? Yeah. All right. Kapow. Okay. Eat it! Masker Worm is one of my favorite cards. And uh, it's it's a scary it's a scary dude. Mississippi Moon on your game on shining on me. No. On, on Mike B. Don't tell my moon what to do. <laughs> that gif is amazing. Wow. <laughs> it's so disturbing at the same time. I'll leave it up for you. I can't look away. You'll never look away. I do not miss Titans and Worm Coil and Standard with Jace. That format was... You don't like that? No, because that was like... I think that was the the epitome of Battlecruiser Magic where you're just... Oh, this hand is amazing. Where you're just playing like the biggest, dumbest thing you can each turn. It was so hard. I actually really like that format. Did you really? Yeah. I love playing with Jace. I mean, Jace was banned. Before he wasn't, it was a good time. My favorite deck was probably the deck that played uh, Jace and Splinter Twin. Was that because it was the only way you could win games of Magic, you think? Uh, I mean, I did win games of Magic. See, there you go. Mike B, winning games of Magic since that format began and ended. That was a joke. I'm just messing around with I'm just, I'm just messing with me. You don't have to cry. I'm going to cry. Don't cry. I'll cry right now. All right, please cry. I was actually baiting you. I wanted you to cry. Me, 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 me. Believe it, I actually enjoyed like Call Blade Mirrors. Oh, oh God, <laughs> they're super skill intensive. I actually enjoy vomiting in my mouth over and over. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy! Oh, we got the Jess guy here with the three basics. Woo! 
Did we shuffle? Oh, it was preordained. Never mind. I'm trying to figure things out, Michael. So what? They shuffled? They didn't shuffle? What are you going to do about it? I don't know, actually. Yeah, what are you going to do about it? That's a good point. Well, if they didn't shuffle, they have a plan. If they did, they don't have a plan. No. Maybe their plan is to have no plan. Maybe your plan is to shut up. It's clearly not. You'll never do that. Yeah, I'm not. No. (laughs) Never happening. Oh, oh, oh. One plan. Oh, this guy's dead. This guy's never been dead or lightning. He looks burst lightning. I just bailed for Strix was in modern. This hand is great. I don't know if... I don't know if big money grip, I don't know if you were being serious or not, but this hand is, that was a good draw. Unfortunately, our opponent doesn't have any creatures. How's what? I said I wish Baleful Strix was in modern. I do too. It is one of the main cards I wish was in modern. It's a little bird. You get to draw a card. You get to block a guy. I like drawing cards. I like birds and I like all kinds of things. You ready for the, uh, the Entreat the Angels up here? I'm ready. Nope, they just firebolt it. That's actually just fine. What's better here, Scarab God or Scary Larry or Obby Bobby? <laughs> I think it's I think it's Obby Bobby. Obby Bobby, give me that card. Stop doing things. What is this? What are you doing? Oh, three little babies. Three little babies popped out of my deck. <laughs> do, 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 do. Any card I want to see reprinted in Dominaria? Um, honestly, no. I just kind of want to see new cards. I want to see new cards that would be, exist in Dominaria because I like that plane. I like the story that I like the story and the nostalgia that goes along with Dominaria. And uh, I just can't wait to see what's gonna what's gonna happen. God, I hate you. I hate everything about you. You, you are. I am. I. You're. You, you are. need new Karn. New Tolarian Academy. His name is Kern. Kern. Hey, what up, Big Kern? You think Big Kern knows Big Worm? God, I hope so. What up, Big Kern? I mean, Big Worm. I feel like we're in good shape here, but who's to say? You know. You think we'll get an actual Urza Planeswalker? God, I hope so. Maybe not, though, because they kind of did that in the unset. Everything in the back... Yeah, that's true. Everything in those years, those days, like the the Dominaria days, quote-unquote, was either too absolutely bonkers broken to ever see play in Modern, if it was printed now, or extremely unplayable. There is, like, such no in-between. Oh, yeah. Wow, six $1 Mythics, huh? That's no good. That's no bueno, as the kids say. No bueno. Well, that's a big, that's a big fat daddy. That's a big fat daddy. Do we draw a card here or do we just guarantee kill this guy? That guy's pretty scary. It is. It is scary. We can also just play Scarab God and get him back with Scarab God. Which I think is really good. I think that's very good, Michael. Oh, boy, oh boy. Huh? How good do you think it is? Uh, I don't want to ever talk to you again. Why not? Because I look, man, I just don't. God. Yeah, I was drawn us like a million cards. I'm gonna eat a dude and eat another dude. Two dudes have been eaten. Um, how fun are you gonna have? How much fun are you gonna have playing an Armageddon in 25 draft? Um. How much fun am I going to have playing it? Or how much fun am I going to have when it's played against me? Because those are two very different answers. Hmm. Hmm. You're getting that back soon. Pretty good. And we get to scry. And they take a damage. The problem with... The only card I want... The, the problem with reprinting cap size is that... Um, do we keep this? I don't think they'll like cap size in standard. You can't because you'd have to have the buyback mechanic in that set, which means it's probably not going to happen. They don't really like you to be able to bounce any permanent. 
Well, plus, it, like they just don't print bouncing lands anymore. Well, the bigger thing is that you don't have you you would have to have buyback as the mechanic in the set. I think that's the bigger. The bigger I, mean, thing. I wouldn't mind buyback, but I don't think cap size is okay. <laughs> uh, Tree of Redemption is in. Is in Magic Twenty Five. What's Tree of Redemption? The one that like you tap and exchange life totals, like a zero thirteen, and you exchange life totals with its toughness. Oh, why? Right, exactly. When that's when that's people's initial response, you should probably second guess putting it in the set. <sighs> oh, why? Just why? Uh, it's because we also put Triskaidillion in the set, and you could kill him with it. What? <laughs> That, that weird card that deals 13 damage. I know what you're saying, Michael. Triska I don't know what that card is. What, Triska Dickadelian? What is Triska that? Triska Dickadelian. No one knows what you're saying. Tricky Dickadee. Actual no one. Tricky Dickadee. I'm a little scared of this Kaiga. I'm going to be honest with you. You should be. It's very good. I admitted that I was. I don't know why you're still. I don't know why you're going on about this. One, two, three, four. Let's get a Baleful... No, I just want Moldrifter, right? Sure. That draws two cards. One, two, three. We're in upkeep, though. Like, how many cards do we really need? One, two, three, four, five, six. So we have nine cards. Oh, Triskaidekaphobia. Yes. Like I said, Triskaidekaphobia. I thought you were talking about Triskelion, and I was like, that's just a creature. No. No. Don't be dumb. I don't want Bone Shredder, because I don't want to kill the Kaiga. Oh, Doomsday is in this? Gross. You're gross. Thank you. Like, if we block the Kaiga, they just take our Scarab God. Yep. Although, Scarab God is not really good if you can't activate him. But, the alternative is, they block with the, the Kaiga, and they both die. Uh-huh. I just don't like a Death Toucher back. Well, Drifter, let's draw some cards. I'd rather just get Baleful Strix back. Okay. Draw a card. Scry two. Heroes down. I don't want either of these to be lost. We don't really have to attack. We don't, but I want to win the game. You like winning the game? It's alright. It's okay. Actually, that goes to five. We can block here, and then they steal Scarab God. Do we have a way to get Scarab God back? We just attack a battlefield, deal on four, and then try to kill him with the strike. I agree with you. I actually think that's a pretty solid strategy. Um, I don't care about any of these, to be honest with you. Nickel Bolas God Pharaoh. Nicky Biggie. Da, 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 da. I'm Burger King. Wow. What's up, man? If you want to trade here, we can trade here. And Is that tree a mythic out. rare? Yeah. Oh, God. Why? Yeah, that's what people are like. When I saw that, I cried. It's like the power levels are not equal. You got like Imperial Recruiter, Doomsday, Jace, the Mind Sculptor, and then, oh, the stupid tree. Ooh. It is a stupid tree. You're right. Where are you coming at? You coming at Ashy? Well, I'm just gonna let you have that because I don't want you to uh, kill him a bit. Kill me, kill me, bear, me bear, bearful Strix. What? You heard me. I did. I just don't understand. You will one day. Oh, a terminus is coming. Or not? Or maybe. But I remember someone complaining about a Chroma Angel of Fury, and then you see the card like the tree. Please. Oh, we just went. All right, cool. All right. Hey, Frank, first off, thanks for uploading all the content, especially your streams on YouTube. Helps us work in steps a ton. Been following articles for six, seven years now. Don't know if you remember the deck, which you made an article based on unexpected results. Omniscious. Literally, someone talked to me about that this weekend. RNG just blessed me, and I ran hot with that deck four weeks running. Easily one of my favorite standard decks to date. Anyway, just a fun memory I wanted to share. Dude, Drew Seppi, thank you so much for saying so, man. I really appreciate it. And. Funny enough, um, yeah, that's one of my most popular, like, that's the article people talk about the most. Every, people always bring that up to me. They're always like, hey, do you remember the unexpected results deck? Where we went, like, 
turn two unexpected results into like omniscience into like something like ridiculous played our hand won the game it was probably the most memorable decks i've ever played yeah that deck was pretty cool i'm pretty cool in the sewer where you live <laughs> oh i see yeah this didn't think about that one. i'm gonna mulligan this hand i agree this hand's pretty good i'm gonna keep this hand agree i'm gonna keep you on the tippy top oh elk tears elk, elk tears and quacker 2000 in the, in the same stream oh my god the brooklyn the brooklyn love is so real right now Yeah, uh, and the Omnigore Thragonfire deck was also uh, pretty insane. That was a really fun deck. I played that FNM a couple times. That was a really fun deck. Ho, ho, ho. I've been smoking for 30 years. That was a really fun deck. I played it at my FNM all the time. In between in, in between cigarette breaks, I mean. You say that, but there's plenty, plenty of players who, if are still playing Magic in like 10 years, are going to sound exactly like that. I agree with you, actually. That's, at, at the shop. You are not wrong. Michael, I just want to talk to you. Did you see the new Jace card that's being printed right now? I think we just won this game. Oh, God. Oh, God. It's old prayer hands. It's all. Dab on the haters. Wait, that's not. What is. It's the crack gate guy, right? The crack style guy? Yeah. That's good. I'm glad he got his own invitational card. <laughs> <laughs> oh man crack gate yeah that was always my goal my goal was always to play the decks that no one else is playing because they don't get a lot of love hey man give me a scroll a scroll yeah i was looking at the spoilers oh my bad how about right there that's good all right let me know when you're done i'm done that's it really yeah it's, oh. it doesn't take very long yeah that's what she said hmm, sounds like a bad time it wasn't good Drew sent me 10 bones, just a way to show some appreciation for the constant content. Thank you so much, man. Really appreciate it. And if you guys didn't know, I do actually upload all my streams to YouTube on a daily basis at 11 a.m. Eastern. So if you happen to miss anything, just feel free to check it out. It's youtube.com slash Frank Lepore. Easy enough. I feel like there's going to be a secure the waist. Uh, secure the waist for one, two. Secure the waist. Is that what it's called? Maybe. How much do I have to donate for you to talk like Smoker Lady for a draft for the entire draft? Oh, God. That is a really painful voice to do. What if we did it for out, through the draft portion? Because I could do that. I think. Uh, Imperial Recruiter is actually a combo piece in Aluren. In, in Legacy Aluren. It lets you get any of the pieces of the deck that you need for the combo. Like uh, Cavern Harpy. It's a combo piece in a lot of decks. Yeah, it also gets like painter servant. It gets a lot of things. It's actually very, very relevant in legacy. Yeah, I'm glad to see that one. Nice way for to get that card. I think if you're in an iconic masters set, or not iconic masters, but Magic's 25th anniversary masters, you put the f you put the fucking Christopher Rush art on the lightning bolt. That's what I think. I yeah, think that's that would have been nice. I think that's the least you can do as wizards, especially because he's rip. Ri 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 yeah, especially because he just passed away. That's exactly why you put it on there. That would have been such a great sign of respect for, for the for the classic lightning bolt art. Because I'm pretty sure that would be the first Christopher Rush art in the new frame. Yeah, that'd be cool. That's how I feel about that. So that's why you got the F word on me right there. Because that is not... That seems so obvious. They lost... The, okay, they lost the rights to that. But that does not seem like something you can't get back. I guess we're just passing here. Can I just bounce a land? I don't think so. I guess we're just ash shocking forever. Dark Dwellers too? Oh, man. We're getting the gems here. We're getting the Spice Boys. The Spice Boys. I'm getting a lot of good stuff here. They're at 18, so they're basically dead. They can't do old art due to commissions. What what's what's to stop them from making an offer to like the Chris Rush estate and just buying it back? 
I don't know. Yeah, like Hasbro has no interest in spending money when they can avoid it. Like, I'm 100% sure Chris Rush, the Chris Rush estate, whoever has the rights to that art is not anywhere near as interested in, like, hoarding it and not getting not getting it to, like... It just seems like they could buy it and the Chris Rush estate would be more than willing to, 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 to let them do that because it would be such an honor to Chris Rush. It would be such a great gesture, right? And I don't know, like, to be fair, I'm not a, I'm not, I don't know the back ends of things like this. Like, I don't know how they, how they work. Right. So I'm not going to be like, couldn't they just do the, can't they just buy it? Cause maybe it's, maybe it's more technical than that. Maybe there's contracts and legalese and I don't know, but it's frustrating to not see the Chris Rush art. On or the if not, I would like to at least see a different art than the, than the, like the same one from M10. Well, you're just greedy. Yeah. Greedy's good. <laughs> Michael Gecko, ladies and gentlemen. Do I put his OG to play? Seems all right. Or do I just keep going? We just keep X on. There are 15 cards. We're just going to keep X on. Nothing there. What are we got? What are we getting here? Cold Steel Heart, Control Magic, Remand, Firebolt. So there's some kind of control deck, eh? Some kind of way. Eh? Way. I feel like they got some miracles. I really don't want a Gilded Lotus here. I think we I think we might be safe to do it though. It's not that big a deal. You're not that big a deal. Got wow. him. Wow. Don't you know who I am? No, I have no idea. Can you tell me? My name is Chef. The, the, I'll be honest. The negative X is tempting. You're right, two vips. I just got to stay the course, though. You know, you just got to keep X on those cards. Your name is not Jeff. You damn liar. I said Chef. That's not your name either. How do you know? You don't. Ooh, sneak attack. That's a little scary. They have no mana up, right? Currently. Okay. Okay, some type of way. One, two, three, four. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just cyclonic rift it. Because if they can untap and play it, we could be in in bad shape. But if we're able to subvencer it next turn, they don't have a second red, so. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Some type of it. Sower of Temptation. All right. We're getting somewhere. So let's go four, five. Solemn. Keep up, Vencer. Let's get that one mountain, huh? Uh, uh, we don't have it in the deck. No, we didn't, never did. Never did. Never didn't have it. We only it. did that when we boarded in an uh, hour. An uh, hour. I'm going to keep this uh, Belfast Strix up in case we got to block like a... An Emrakul or something ridiculous. You never know. How's the deck doing? We're 1-1 right now, and we are... So, the thing I've come to figure out the hard way, I think, is that all the Master sets are pretty bad for value. You mean like... Uh... Modern Masters, Iconic Masters, Vintage Masters, they're all pretty bad for value. Vintage Masters, not so much because it was on Magic Online and you can get like $50, $70 power. But even after a while, that became pretty bad. So I thought the one set was pretty okay for it. Which one? The the blue one? What was the blue one called? The blue one? The blue Masters set? Yeah. I have no... It was like all blue. Like the box was blue. That was just the most recent one, right? When the new Modern Masters with all the... All right, got him. All right, thank you guys so much for watching on YouTube. Really appreciate it. Be sure to slam those like and subscribe buttons if you appreciate the content and you'll get notifications. Hit the bell too. You'll get notifications whenever I go, whenever I post a new video, which is at 11 a.m. Eastern pretty much every day. So uh, yeah, have a good night and I'll see you guys later.